Here we are. We are playing some Monster Hunter Rise today. Also, I noticed like last time the colors looked a, a little off to me, so I increased the gamma and contrast a little bit. So hopefully it looks a, a little better this time in terms of colors. So yeah, we're gonna be playing. <gasps> Look at my animals! So if you guys weren't here last time, say hello to my new buddies. The, the doggo over here, the Palamute, is based off of an African wild dog, one of my favorite endangered animals. And then the one on the left is based off of my old childhood cat, Kitty. All the games we play, we stream, so we gotta wait for stream. <laughs> That's true. That's true. I mean, I've been playing, I've been playing Stardew Valley uh, off stream uh, a lot. So. <laughs> okay, let's go, let's go. Oh wait, I have a character edit voucher? Oh, I get, I get, you get vouchers? You can't like edit your character constantly? I did not have that game. Oh shoot. <laughs> I've been wanting to play Stardew Valley more with friends. I'm like, I need a I need to bug my my friends to play Stardew with me. Cause it's an urge I've been getting. Yeah, only one voucher for life? Really? Really? You can only edit once? My goodness. Okay, so we gotta talk to Hinoa, the quest maiden. Wait, I wanna, I wanna ride my horse. <laughs> ride my horse. <laughs> ride, ride my dog. Kitty, come here. Oh, look at him run. Look at him run on all fours. Look at that baby. Look at him. Look at him. He's a little lad. He's a little lad. He's just a little boy. That's a small horse, just saying. Then what is this? My dog is Pascal and the cat is Mogu Mogu. Let me see. Let me see, let me look at this. Let me look at this. Ah, <gasps> oh, that's so cute! Mogu Mogu. <laughs> I know exactly why you named this cat Mogu Mogu. I can even see from the colors. <laughs> Pascal. Pascal, the dog is here. <laughs> Very excellent, 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 excellent. I was I was debating on making my dog be uh, based off of Repeat from Tales of Vesperia, but I wanted to make an African spotted dog. Everyone, please follow and subscribe Elio Lefty, aka Starry Bunny Boy, on Twitch, Twitter, YouTube, TikTok, Kofi, and Patreon for more content. He's Pog. No, not you too. Okay, where is he now? Is she over here? I wanted to close the injure image. Pascal the dog is here. I forgot where Hinola was at. Oh, I think she was in that one, like, quest area. Oh, you closed Elio's stream by accident? How dare you? Oh, oh, it's you. You're Hinola. Funny dongo or a taste of heaven. What did you say? I, I couldn't hear you. Also, can you guys hear me? Is the is the music too loud? Oh wait, I forgot to turn it down. Let me let me turn it down a bit. It might be a bit too loud. She talked about dongo. Dongo, 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 daikazoku. Oh, Elio Lappy! Already completed your hunter registration? Great! I retrieved your cohoot? <laughs> From Elder Fugen earlier. It's so cute. You're gonna love it. Oh, are we gonna be editing an owl? Cohoots, like buddies, will help you out during quests, but in their own little way. I am gonna be master of all the animals. Master of all four elements? No. Master of all four mammals. Bird cannot be edited. Damn it. Okay, Kohuts are creatures that are beloved throughout Kamura. The village elder gave you a Kohut to look after as a pet. If you call your Kohut from your action bar, it will come and perch on your arm! You mean this is a game about hunting animals? Hunting monsters? This feels like a pet simulator to me and I'm living for it. If a symbol pops up while you have a Kohut on your arm, 
Push it to have your Kohoot take flight. Maybe something will happen. It's unavailable in multiplayer. <gasps> what? <laughs> the pet menu can be opened while a Kohoot is perched on your arm. There you can swap out outfits and feed your feathers, friend. If you feed your Kohoot, they will greet you once you return from your quest. Your Kohoot won't come to greet you in multiplayer. I'm never playing in multiplayer then. <laughs> well, how about you give your new feathery friend a nickname? Wait, wait, what does he look like? Hmm. I'm not naming him Kohoot. I, uh, recommend you do multiplayer. But the L won't show up if I don't play multiplayer. And what if people make fun of me? Okay. What are we naming this L? Hmm. Oh my god. Look at him. He's so cute. Yeah, well, you won't show up if you don't do multiplayer, LMAO. Fine, maybe I, maybe I don't want to show up. <laughs> I think Dwarf meant friend multiplayer. Oh, okay. Well, oh, Dwarf, do you have this on Steam? I wasn't sure if you had it on Switch or on Steam. Let's see. Ah, nah, Switch. I got it on Steam. I don't think this game is cross compatible. Oot. Wait, no, it was like. I can't think of a name. And yeah, you can do friend multiplayer. I was mostly just threatening you that you will die out there. <laughs> ha -ba -ba. Who's that owl from Ocarina of Time? I don't know. I, I forgot what his name was. Kabora Gabor. Oh, that was it. Because he's Kabora Gabora. Anyway, since my sister is swamped at the moment, I'll go ahead and give you the quest rundown instead. Now that you're a hunter, You'll be in charge of completing the quests that me and Minoto have in our quest lists. Some of these quests, called key quests, have been specially posted by the Hunter's Guild. So, if you make a point of completing key quests, the Hunter's Guild will take note. What is this? Reddit? Hey, what's up, bitch ass? <laughs> You're surprised to see me! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Oh, and one last thing. Here, take this petal lace Minoto and I made. Ooh. As you may be aware, petal laces are protection charms woven from a local plant called Ascending Sprig. Pollen carried by spirit birds will enhance your petal lace, strengthening your abilities. Treat it with care. A petal lace is a type of charm bracelet made of woven sending sprigs. And come on, villa, do, 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 do. One at a time. From any spare birds? Special status boosts. Huh. Okay. Switch out from the tense item box. Oh, okay. I head out and relax. You have fun? Alright! You have fun too, dwarf! Oh, I think Minoto should be wrapping up her report right about now. And I need to get back to work myself. Once you're ready, you can start taking quests from either of us. Hold on, you can't go... <laughs> you can't go prancing off before my introduction. How could I, Senri? Elio Lappy! Meow lo! Meow lo! And grats on becoming a hunter! If you ever find yourself taking a hunt quest, then I... Senri, the mailman, have quite the important info for ya. Uh, you'll need to go through me to meet up with fellow hunters. Make sure to stop by. <laughs> well, I think that about wraps everything up. Oh, he's so cute! He's so cute! <laughs> Time to start monster hunting! A fresh wave of DLC. I don't have money. 
download event quest. What did I get? I, I guess I got DLC? That's a lot of stuff. Okay. Okay! Hunter info updated. Village quest kind of... Hold on, let me... Let me go around and introduce myself to, to Kagero. Oh, Spend money at the market to acquire useful items. We can also sell any unwanted materials and decorations for money here. Oh, okay. Let's see, what you, what you got? What you got? Okay, what, what do I have? Okay, so... The stuff that's... In my items... Okay, so I have a potion. I have an antidote. Barrel. What do you need barrels for? Combi oh, combine it with gunpowder to make it into bomb? What, what do you do with an, a small barrel? Small time bomb. Hmm. This must have item for putting it's together pitfall traps and other kinds of traps. Wait, what? They look so dignified. Communication error, what? <laughs> Combustible powder. Combine with level 1 ammo to raise its level. Huh. Shrapnel. Okay, um... Maybe I'll buy, like, a barrel bomb? Coming right up. It's just... Right wait, 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 wait. What is the difference between item pouch and item box? Is that, like, the storage thing? I think? <gasps> Kitty! Kitty! Let me talk to you! Let me talk to you! Where, where are you going? Where are you going, buddy? Where are you going with that? Where are you going with that? You, do you want some help? Ikari? Meowdy, Elio Lappy! So you're a hunter, Meow! Congratulations! Yeah, let me help you. Keep working hard so you can be the best hunter you can be. I'll do the same. But so I can carry these deliveries the best I can carry them. Please be careful, don't hurt your paws! Okay. Oh my god. Good. Good. Seems old Hodge wasted no time finalizing your registration. <laughs> well, now that you're officially a hunter of Kamada Village, it's time for you to get out there and show us what you're made of. Alright, then. Is there something over here? I would put a pet over here. Oh, I put like a bunny to pet over here. Okay, let's see. Oh, I got. Oh, we got a smithy. Oh, the buddy smithy. Hell yeah. Elio Lappy, I hear you're a hunter now. Felicitations and congratulations. If you need buddy equipment, then look no further. The smithy looks forward to your future patronage and your buddies too, of course. As a little token of my thanks, I'd like to present you with some scrap that you can use to forge body equipment. Thank you, Kisaki. Promise me you'll take it and get your buddy some spiffy new equipment? Yes, yes, yes. Uh, let me... Why, why, why does the game... I, I guess like it's trying to load things up. But like, why, why can't I talk to anyone now? Okay, I can talk to her. Can I talk to you again? Elio, you're a nubanoi, right? All these birds. Yeah, I'm just, I just like, I just like cats, okay? <laughs> you forge bunny, buddy, buddy gear from scraps for palicoids and palamutes. And your material rich and scrap poor. Sometimes cutoffs will be generated when creating hunter equipment. These are referred to as scraps. These scraps can be used to create buddy gear. Ooh! Let's see, a palico. Got feline kimura, feline acorn, feline paws, what? I want these! Komoda hood. Look at that! Look at that, that's so cute. Okay, so we need ore scrap, bone scrap, fur scrap. I want the paws. I want that. I want this. 
this. That's cute. Okay. I'll get you this. Yes. I like the hoodie. Yeah. We're gonna keep the hoodie on. Okay. Can't buy anything for... Palamute, though. Chat, yes! Elio Lappy, so I hear you're a hunter, meow. <laughs> Felicitations and congratulations! The Smithy looks forward to your future patronage. And your buddies, of course. He's so cute. He's so cute. He's so cute. Oh. Okay, one thing that's a little annoying is it, it takes a while for the game to load my ability to talk to people. Can I go in here? Oh, I can. That's a nice little room. Got some... Got some onigiri. Oh, is this my house? Maybe? Oh, wait, no, it's their house. Whoops. Sorry. Okay, let's see. You wanna give me some, uh, stuff for visiting you? Use the material gathered to upgrade and forge new equipment. Find up all your quest rewards? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Can you register any equipment that you'd like to forge or upgrade to a wish list? Oh. Oh, okay. Forge, I want... I want dual blades. Okay, materials and money. Okay. Graded weapons can be rolled back. Huh. Some of the scraps of material you use forge weapons cannot be rolled back. Hey? Okay. We got defender weapon tree. I got the Kamura tree. So that's what we got equipped right now. Literally take hours. I'm used to waiting. Okay, so some of these, like, become new trees by, like, making them, I guess? Monster bones. Okay, I guess we can't do that yet. Yeah, forging or upgrading. Okay, what does this look like? Oh, that looks cool. Can't make it, though. Okay, can I... can I wishlist it? Yeah. Yeah. Bow gun, can oh, can insect, insect glades, cold drone, mall drone, a oh, blunt and severing. Take all the time you need. Huh. Shut up. Let me let me look at your wares, okay? Decided on a weapon yet? Don't rush me. You need to determine which style suits you and which weapons will be effective against each quest's target. Is training it? Yeah, I know. I already did that. Okay. I guess we'll... Go talk to Minoto. Where is she at? She, she was in this cave, right? I think. Oh, gotta wait for the game to load up the ability. Okay, there we go. Oh, the hub reception. Oh, the <gasps> There's another cat. My doll. My dory. <coughs> Meow does it, Elio Lappy. I'm my doll. Oh, I know exactly why his name is my doll. Because <laughs> that's what shopkeepers say in Japanese. My dory. <laughs> I'm my doll. Welcome to my shop. We carry all the essentials every hunter needs. So check here before heading meow that quest gate. Okay, well, I guess... Okay, let me... Can I look at your store? He's so cute! The little... The little hat! The little headdress, so cute. Oh, okay, he, he sells the same stuff as that one guy. But he's cuter. So I'll be doing all my purchases here. Once upon a time... I worked at Otemai's, taking stock and pawing all the accounts there. But since they need a proper market here in the hub, 
Otomai asked me to change careers. Good thing, too. I love it here. <laughs> Back at the shop, I and everyone else followed Otomai's instructions, but here, every decision is my own. It's a big responsibility with no room for ever, but I'm positively loving it. Oh, you're so cute. You're so cute. Oh, and now the game's not letting me interact with anything again. Love that. Okay, can I can I change can I change my equipment? Please? Please, game, respond. Okay. Let me let me change my equipment. Okay, we want dual wheel. There we go. Uh, you have to wait even when you change your equipment. There's, there's, there's gotta be, there's gotta be like a setting or something that I can do for this, right? General map toggle. There's gotta be a, there's gotta be a thing here, right? Really? Why does it do that? Don't like that. What would you like to do? I've been waiting for you. As you could have guessed, all gathering hub quests go through me. Hmm? Please be aware these quests are meant for a party of hunters. Quests will be rated at one star, two star, and so on. Think of the number of stars as the level of difficulty. One to three quests are classified as low rank, and four to seven stars are classified as high rank. Oh good, forgot to say. Eh? I'm sure that in no time you will be taking on high rank quests. At least that is what Hinoa says. The questions here are designed for a multiplayer. Ah. You wanna talk to the one outside for solo quests? Oh, okay. Yeah. I'll do solo quests. Cause I, I I don't really know anyone that wants to play it right now, so I'll do solo quests. Here at the hub, your monster rank or HR for short determines what quests you are able to accept. Yeah 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 yeah. You want to participate? Check available quests and their details. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay. Gathering hub quests are for a party of hunters. Uh -huh. May attempt them on your own as well. Oh, I should do solo quests first before I try s soloing a multiplayer game. <laughs> that should be everything. Should. I'll check with Hinoa later to see if I forgot anything. I'll be starting with one star quest. Welcome to the hub. Okay. Okay. Hub quests. Okay, join request to allow hunters and other lobbies to join your quest while in progress. This is disabled for village quests. Yeah, I wanna do village quests. Hunting in a party with others, make sure everyone is prepped for the hunt before setting off. Okay. As you complete quests from the village and gathering hub, the hunter's guild will permit you to take on more and more quests. Okay. Okay, okay. 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 Oh, hunting. Oh, a wyvern riding? I can ride a wyvern? Is it like a like a horse? Subquests. What's that? Subquests are side quests for both quest counters and can be completed any number of times. Huh. Okay, so like if I if I do this, will this count towards village as well? Hold on. See you later then. I'm just gonna go to the village one and see if she lets me accept uh, those kind of quests. Look at th 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 this place is so pretty. They they really did good on making this place actually look lived in. It's a dragon, yee! All right, let's go. I I got no friends to play Monster Hunter with, so I'm gonna do solo quests. What wonderful... It's very important. What? What is? What is? What is, Sunri? Anything that you say is important. Look at him! Look at his absolute pose! Hello there, Elio Lappy. Been waiting on ya. Got some info that's vital. No crucial. No... Pair me out! 
Well, you're just about to hit up the gathering hub so you can get it. No. Got some bad news for you. When the rampage is near, it's forbidden for hunters to leave Komodo. And outside, hunters won't be able to enter either. In other words, Komodo is offline. Oh, okay. If you want to form a party, I have a special type of message I can send to get hi hunters to hightail it here. Komodo will be online and hunters will be able to enter. Just don't ask me how it works. Okay, spiderweb, no! Come to me whenever you want to swap between offline and online. No. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. But I'm not interested in what you are selling. Okay. So we gotta talk to Hinoa. Where's she at? Where's Hinoa at? Well, I can't go out there apparently. Oh, she's right there. <laughs> I am blind. Something came in for me. It's a good day for a hunt. Well, hello there, Elia Lappy. Ready to get into some quests? Yes. Well, you have great timing because a quest just came in for you. Uh huh. Master Utsushi has called for you. Looks like it's time for some basic training. He was so pumped up about being a real inspector. He kept going on and on about being ready to thrash. I'm gonna wreck it. And it seems Elder Fugen may have had a hand in it as well. Although I was told to keep that part a secret, he, why do I look? Why do I look like this? I look so ugly. <laughs> look like I could just committed murder and the police caught me. Uh, no, I was just here at this river, sir. I. I did not dump that body in there. No, please do not look in my car. Yes, that's kerosene. Yes, uh, I, 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 uh, I, I had to buy it because my, my chimney's having problems. I gotta get the kerosene for that. Um, uh, rope? Yeah, uh, I, I'm an architect. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I suspect they've been racking their brains to think of a way to help your hunting career. How sweet. Mm. I've added Utsushi's request to the quest list. Accept it whenever you're ready. Be sure you are ready first, okay? When you are, just head through the quest gate to begin. You playing Monster Hunter? Cries? Yes, I am! Hello, Cal! Now I just head through the quest gate to begin. Let's dive into the quest list. A special quest has been added. Okay, we got... Okay, okay, so we can take these. Okay. She's cute, I like her. Well, Elia Lappy, let's get started with the basic training quest that Utsushi has set up for you. I wonder what he has in store for you. Well, don't just go charging in. Make sure you're fully prepared first. Okay, let's do it. Which quest would you like? Back to basics. 12 zennies, shrine ruins, 50 minutes, Kelby Bafango, Gajal, Gargwa, Gargwa, Feline, Feline, Banahabra, Altaroth, Bombaji. No outbreaks or upsurges. Yo, Ace, a hunter's never too good to go over the basics. Huh, okay. Let's take it on. Okay, so... I depart. Yes. Let's depart. Master Utsushi, you can harvest nearby plants, nuts, bugs, mushrooms, bones, honey, and spiderwebs. Your mining outcrops will allow you to mine them. Oh my god, it's just like Minecraft. Stand here and press B to begin carving parts from it. Oh yeah! Sanctuary abandoned by the gods. Ooh. Ooh, look at those! Dudes! Once so bustling. So pretty. Oh, what did so you put in chat, Song? <laughs> Hunters beware. Not wait, but despair. Oh no, Junko, you shouldn't have. <gasps> My owl! 
Yo, Ace, what's up? Accepting my quest, huh? Nice. Let me let me look at this. Let me look at what song put. Elio, I've only had insert any animal for a day and a half. If anything happened to him, I would kill everyone in this room and then myself. This is literally me. I see an animal and I go crazy. <laughs> Gives me Oriental Grove vibe. I could see that. Definitely. <laughs> Come over here and we'll get started. Welcome. Love the way this man moves. We got like a time limit. We got a supply box. Okay, what what you what you talking about, dude? Ready to thrash? Congrats again on making honor. A whole new life awaits. <laughs> he's so he looks like he's so pumped up for stuff. Heh. <laughs> See it in your eyes that you're ready to thrash. Let's do a little quest refresher first. Cool. Oh hi there, Toss Mark. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to my Monster Hunter stream. How you doing? Let's start with our camp here. Oh, is this where we recover? Change your equipment and weapons or organize your items. Mm. Oh, okay. You're free to switch out your gear inside. Oh, okay. That's the supply box. <laughs> Everything in there is provided by the guild, so feel free to take and use whatever you want. Oh, okay. Free, free items. Let's go. That's it for the camp. Let's move on to the next part. The river past the ledge. If you get lost, just look at my icon on your map. Okay. Oh, this is big. Okay, leaving for a hunt. Switch skills, access the buddy board. And eat meals. I'm provided with hunting items. Okay. Okay, what we got? Triangles indicate players' current locations. White, ten white tent symbols are camps. Monsters, buddies, traps, and place items, as well as severed tails are displayed too. Quest objectives are also denoted during special quests. Okay. Zoom in. Endemic life. Huh? Detailed map. That's a toggle. Oh, the icon list. I'll probably be doing that. Okay. Okay. Okay, let's see. Okay, helpful items to your supply box. Don't forget to split these with your allies if you're hunting in a party. Okay. I'm gonna take all of these. Empty file. Wait. Oh, I guess I guess those were worth I if I had different weapons. Okay. Let's head on out. What? Wait. Where's my? Where's my animals? Hold on. Let's do this. On top of these boulders. Shut up. Where's my animals? Item box. Where's my animals? Buddy boy cannot be used for this quest. Noble tea shop. I got points. What? Uh. Bunny dango. Okay, hold on. Well, this is just this is just a. Let's do this. This is just a basic quest. So I don't I don't think I need to waste money on this one, right? Oh, harvest nearby plants, nuts, bugs, mushroom. Okay. okay let's see what we got. Okay, our craft items from the item box near house. Use the auto craft function. Okay. <gasps> Recipes or oh, eat the plants. It's just like me when I was in elementary school. For real, for real. Okay. If I jump from here, will I will I get hurt? I probably will, well won't I? Okay, let's There we go. I'm smart. Hey, hero. Hey, up here. Hmm. All right, let's talk wire bugs. These bodacious, these bodacious babes are a must in any hut. He is definitely a surfer, dude. 
Use them right and you'll be able to zip around pretty much anywhere you want to go. Even on top of this boulder. Yeah. Gnarly, bruh. Give it a shot. Kill him. <laughs> variety of actions can be preferred using the extraordinary creature. Rapid aerial maneuvers with wire dash. What about weapon specific gambits with silk bind? Or gain composure with wire fall? Okay. Degree of consumption. Capturing a wild wire bug will temporarily increase the gauge by one. Combo to hunters. While pressing left trigger, press Y to move vertically. Press B to move forward. To move where you're air aiming. Wall running. Has its own unique skill bind action using a wire bug. These cannot be used with your weapon sheet. To use it, draw your weapon, hold LT, Blade Master, RB, Gunner. Huh. Okay. Okay. Ah, uh huh. Okay. Alright, there's a wire bug. You grab it. Okay, cool. To scale the boulder. Okay. Oh, paper set. Whoops. Wall traveled hunter's technique. Perform a wire dash while facing a wall or dash towards a wall to initiate a wall run. Okay. And wall run, hold on RB to continue running. Oh, we got stamina. Oh, th that must be the green stuff or something. Wall run by climbing ivy. Oh, okay. Wait, where are those bugs? I want to grab them. Okay. I've been waiting for you. You alright, Ace? Why are bugs giving you trouble? Okay. Medical is okay. Right. Okay. Today I brought my pal. This pal. Why do they look piss colored? <laughs> Flash and Rumble with me. Mm. They'll be lending you a paw for this part of the training. Why are your animals piss colored? <laughs> These are my animals. Piss and urine. They piss on my carpet. <laughs> they piss all over themselves. They leave a permanent stain. First, try mounting Rumble, my pal and mute. Mm. I don't want to mount your piss mute. <laughs> pal mutes are swift as the wind, so if a monster gives you a slip, hop on your bark and buddy. <laughs> oh, that's cute, though. Bark and buddy. We're waiting for you up the trail. Okay. I have access to the let me ride command. Okay. Alright. Oh, we can attack while we're riding them? Jumping dismount. What stones and other items can be used while riding a palamute? When riding, select a usable item and press X to use it. Oh. Give it a try. Listen up! Oh, you can attack. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Alright. Let's head over here. Uh, it was this. Okay, I got a bug. Oh, wait. Come here. Come here. Oh. Can I not get you? Trap bugs. Not a problem. Oh wow, that's there's so much stuff. Hold on, I wanna I wanna grab this stuff. Let's see. Honey, give me some honey, honey. Okay. Attention, please. Is that shit? Oh my god, no, no. Oh, you stop simping over the parents. Oh wait, this isn't our life anymore. <laughs> Hello, Twy. Hey, How do you know? How'd you know I was simping over my mommy? <laughs> hey, check out this yellow spirit bird. If you touch one, its pollen will enhance that good luck charm you're wearing your petalese. When that happens, the scent of the pollen surrounds your petalese and boosts your stats. This guy is so extra. So this little guy is yellow, it'll increase your piss. Your piss droplets. <laughs> Similarly, 
Spear buds of other colors will boost other stats. Pretty gnarly, if you ask me. The effect is only active during the current quest, but you can be sure as sure <laughs> you can be sure as shurikens <laughs> that they're worth using. I see it was a correct guess. Yes. Can you guess how I feel about Cove? Oh, and that's a cloth fly over there. I already grabbed one, but I'll grab another. Cloth flies are one of the many creatures you'll come across out in the field. We call these little guys endemic life. Powder these floaty friends spread can boost your defenses. Mm. It's other, okay. 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 I'm of buffers and hunting helpers. Okay. Phase one cove or what you've seen from like the preview and stuff. Phase one cove. Phase one cove. Just him. Just him. Okay, come here. Get that defense up, buff. What, what does this do? Blind. Can I blind people? Doing great. Okay, so that's like a crafting item. Attention, please. Attention, please. Hold on, let me get. Yeah, let me get that. Sup, Ace? Right on, Ace. Get the hang of riding Palamutes already. I'm not. I'm not Ace. I'm not an antagonist in 999. Mm -hmm. They're super helpful buddies, especially when you need to cover a lot of ground. A little scrunkly runkly. If anyone hurts him, I will stab you repeatedly. Actually, quite the opposite. Quite the opposite. <laughs> I did not. I. Me and Cole fought. Me and Cove got in. Me, me and Cove got in a tussle. Me and Cove got in a tussle. He he insulted me, so I insulted him back. We're 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 not on good terms right now. <laughs> I'm not ace. I thought you were asexual. Oh, that's true. That's true. Maybe he's just referring to me by my sexuality. Okay. I mean, that that's a little weird, but okay. Hi, my bi buddy. <laughs> Elio, I'm going to fight you. Why? He insulted me, Twy. And you can even tell them to attack while you're riding them. <laughs> but their attacks won't be as strong as yours. So when you're ready to get down to business, it's best to dismount. Oh, looks like we got ourselves some monsters nearby. Why, why would I lose my health and stamina? Uh -huh. I've just been running around. Time to get the show on the road. Okay. Cove is my scrunkly runkly. Well, he insulted my scrunkly runkly. I forgot what his name was, but he's my scrunkly runkly. The green bar is your health gauge. Run out of health and you'll faint. Okay. Stamina gauge. Length of your stamina gauge. Okay, so it's like, it's like, it's like Breath of the Wild. Spirit bird then your quest will increase okay. You two hunt me and anyone else with common sense. He insulted my boy! He insulted me and my boy. Hey hero. Gnarly, a pack of Izuchi. Nasuga? Alright, there's three of them. Go take them out for me. Don't hold back just because they're small now. They can be skillful and ruthless. Just remember your training and you'll be golden. Okay. Yeah, but, but he insulted me. Wait. Stink monk. Stink mink. Pheromones that attract monsters. Come here. Oops. Okay, that's the button. Excellent. That's my ace. Going down. Wow, <laughs> that's my ace. Yo, my favorite. Kind of gay. It's kind of gay, my dude. <laughs> Friendship ended with Elio. Now Cove is my best friend. Yeah, Shiloh. He insulted Shiloh. Okay. How dare you enable Shinny mode? Izuchini? Hi. 
We just killed some easy chinis. Uh oh. <laughs> Bruh, remember your train and you will be golden. Looks in purple cut. <laughs> awesome job there, Ace. Oh, and don't forget to carve to harvest materials from monsters. Hmm. Okay. You done carving? Come see me. Okay. Where's the carcasses? Alright. Well, time to get my hands dirty. Time to get my hands dirty. Okay, we got a sharp claw. Any more? Oh, well, I, I didn't mean to get on you, buddy. Come on. Oh, no, no, I, oh, oh, okay, okay, hold on. Wrong button. Here we go. I'll make you regret your words, Elio Lappy. I'll make you regret your words. Just, just watch my playthrough of it, Twy. Then you'll understand. Then you'll see all. You'll, you'll understand. Let me get this ginormous nut. Oh Let's boy, see. I'm nut. Oh wait, that's honey. Also, you like my Komida voice. Oh, another wire bug. Never seen anyone dislike Ko. Granted, I've only seen like two other people, but still, yeah, you chosen different, probably. Yeah, I did. Stop, face. Just as I expected from my star pupil. That was an incredible hunt. If there's something you think you could have done better, don't worry. After all, you're just getting started. Mm. Now then, let's head back to camp. It looks like we're kind of far away from it. But, no big deal, yo. Use fast travel and you'll be back at camp in no time. Okay, how do I... Okay, fast travel... Oh, oh, okay. Is it this button? No, that's the, that's the screenshot button. You know what? Open map, oh, okay. Fast travel, main camp, okay. <laughs> The giant nut comment. <laughs> Do I have to go back? I wanna. Okay, let's huh? see. Am I almost done with this? Hanging in there. Congratulations! You completed this basic training quest. Now proud to send you out into the field as a full-fledged hunter. Learned well, but keep in mind, Elder Frugan and I expect much from you. Uh -huh. I'll be bodacious, babe. If you ever feel like going over your basic training again, all you need to do is accept this quest from Hinoa. Okay. Well, I don't wanna return to the village. Oops. I wanna, I wanna kill Stav. No, no, don't, don't that return me to the village, haha! -ha. Let's go home. That is not my cat. Yeah. That is not my cat. That is not my cat. Where is my cat? Where is Kitty? Okay, we got. Oh, we got some meat. Flooded forest fish. We can fish in this game? Okay, I'll take them. Oh, I got an achievement. I don't know what it is though. It's, it's cut off from the screen. I adopted your cat? No, give her back. She's my cat. New cutscene has been added. And obtained an award. Okay, we got, got some points. We got some money. Okay. I can't believe you took $20 from the dad and still fought with Cove. I haven't seen anything, I'm just guessing. <laughs> Why are you reading me like a book, Ty? Yes, I did take the $20. I also didn't tell him that I took the $20. <laughs> I had the chance to open up to Cove about how his dad gave me $20 and I didn't tell him that I took the $20. <laughs> <laughs> Well, Elio Lappy, I see Utsushi's little quest was no match for you. <laughs> I expect nothing less. What you learn today is the very essence of hunting. Wherever the hunt takes you, those lessons will always hold true. I was like, your next words are, I took the $20. <laughs> well, what do you expect? It's $20.
$20 is $20. That's $20 I wouldn't have if I didn't take it. Now, you know I should have some one-star quests ready for you. Okay. Oh, I, I cleared an optional soul quest. I didn't think I grabbed enough. But that's cool. Okay. I wanna, I wanna talk to more people. Once the game lets me. But you didn't befriend him! It wasn't paying me to befriend him. It was paying me as motivation to possibly befriend him. But it wasn't like a you have to befriend him. Hey, hey Elio Lappy. I heard you're a hunter now. Congratulations. The rampage on the way. Master Hallmon's really busy. Yeah, he's getting all the wine glasses ready to spill. Which means my apprenticeship is on hold for now. Well, with all this free time, I can focus on mustering up the courage to talk to my beloved Hinoa. Look at me. Is this the face of a man you want to tell that you are simping for the women that I simp for, buddy? I was just talking earlier about how I look like I just committed a murder. Do you want me to commit two? One murderer killing another murderer means that there's still the same amount of murderers left in the world. But if one murderer kills two people, then I'm a serial killer. <laughs> oh, Hinoa, a shining light of all common on my ray of sunshine. Uh, she can't hear me, can she? Shh, silence, simp. <laughs> so Elio pulled a kill. <laughs> Well, wasn't it Sunny that took his money? Well, we, we can take the money back. Oh yeah, I'm sure that's what Cliff had in mind. That's why you forgot, for, you're forgetting that Elio's love life is enemies to lovers, true? <laughs> Hold up, you're actually very right. Maybe that's why I'm not getting along with Cove. It's my love language. <laughs> Still mad at nine-year-old Elio for his crimes against Clove. Get mad at Clove for his crimes against me! Fail to take your means of protection seriously and you won't last long out in the field. Prove your armor. Okay. Oh, later. use it to upgrade my gear. Thank you. But we can steal it back. Oh, okay. That, that was it. He did take our money. Thank you, Kel. Okay, I wanna talk. Well, I already talked to someone that I hadn't talked to before. When when are you guys gonna load up? Thank you. Okay, Bunny Dango. You got something for me. What you got? You got a doggy? I'll take your doggy. I'll take Homura. I'll I'll, I'll give Homura a a, a palico named Madoka. Good to see you, Elio Lappy. Yeah. Good, good that you're looking at my back, sir. How's the hunting life treating you? There's something I'd like you to do, on top of your normal monster hunting duties, that is. If you ever hear of any villager having trouble, I want you to lend him an ear. If you can help, lend him a hand too. Of course, I'll get money for that, right? You're gonna give me $20 for, for talking to these villagers, right? I don't have to actually be kind to them. I just have to take the chance to talk to them. But if I don't like them, you're still gonna pay me the money. No, it's all of a sudden, though, no, but don't worry. I got something nice and easy to get you used to it. I need you to bring me something. Think you can do that? Come back and see me when you're ready. <laughs> quest start type of side quest. Okay, slaying monsters. Okay. Deliver an item. Okay. I feel like the R live streams will be me arguing with Elio because of our different opinions of Cove, followed by arguing with Elio because we have the same opinions on the parents. <laughs> Mummy? Okay, fulfilling a quest. Okay. So I need to give him a, a well done steak. Okay, so I need to make a steak. Hey. Do I make it myself or- oh wait, I haven't called my- my Kohut yet. I want to look at my Kohut. His name's Hubbepa. Yes! Yes! 
Yes! Yes! Look at that bird! Look at that owl! Run! Best game! Best game! Okay, pet menu. Change clothes. Change co oh, I can change his color. Okay. Okay, I'm I'm gonna customize my bird. Oh wait, oh wait, that's just the clothes. I wanted to change his pelt. Okay, well you'll be purple, I guess. No, you'll you'll be green. Nice, nice little green. And then the red. That's good. <gasps> Feed! Counting on you. Yes! <gasps> Look at him! Oh, he's happy! <gasps> Glad you've got my back. <gasps> Counting on you. I need to see your, your cute, lovely face. Oh. Oh, you got something new for me? Add on content. Send out join requests. I don't have friends. I don't care. Add on content. Can I get free DLC? No add-on content. Wait, what? What is that? Not yet received. How do I receive them? Okay, these must be like later... Later things for me to do, probably. I'll do these later. I wanna just enjoy, I just wanna enjoy the game in, it, in its base form first. And then I'll do the DLC stuff. Elio, don't get too far. I need you. Add laptop for mom. Huh? Okay. <laughs> wow. How, how dare you leave me in my moment of need, Twy. Oh, those are event quests that you can play once you get far enough. Oh, okay. What, what is she saying? Bunny Dango. How are you today? Hey, and welcome back. How'd everything go with Master Tsushi's quest? I know, I know. The basics are, well, basic, but you gotta have a sturdy foundation before you can build, right? I left you for Cove. Oh, fuck you too, Twy. Hmm? Take Bunny Dongo, for example. Yomogi puts as much effort into selecting ingredients as she does preparing them. <laughs> anyway, I know you're not here to talk Dango. I'm always here to talk Dango, actually. And lucky for you, I've got some one-star quests ready to go. Look at my dog, Hinoa. Do, do you like do you like men that have dogs? Probably don't like that man standing over there talking about how you're her sunshine. His sunshine or anything, right? That's kind of cringe, right? But a dude with a dog and a cat is attractive. <laughs> anyway, I know you're not here to talk to you, you're here for quests. And lucky for you, I've got some one-star quests ready to go. Kind of like climbing a mountain. Keep completing them, and before you know it, you'll be at the top. Ah. Oh yeah, yeah. I already did one of the the single player quests. I'm probably not gonna do the the other twins stuff because if I want to play multiplayer, I want to play it with like friends and not random people on stream, <laughs> or like anyone that watches my stream that wants to play with me. Okay. Pick the quests right for you and forge your own quest. 
But you're gonna stay right here and listen to me blabber about Bunny Dango if you don't hurry up and take a quick. What if I want to listen to you talk about Bunny Dango? Well, does she know the foundation Elio built was future foundation? Future between me and her. <laughs> How about this leather? Hmm? Oh, I got some. Oh, oh yeah, because I did a sub quest. Okay, let's see training quests. Okay, let's take on. I already got honey. Okay, training quests. Let's just use quests. Okay, I did that. Went to Wyvern, right? And she makes bunnies into Dingle. No, it's because bunnies like Dingle. Because Dingle is like a thing from the moon that they make on the moon. So they call it Bunny Dingle. Okay, let's see. Pretty gnarly technique where you use wire bugs to control a monster. Okay. Let's try it out. Good luck. Alright, let's depart. I wanna ride the bunny monster. I heard there's a bunny monster in this game. I wanna I wanna take control of that one. Go on a rampage. Stage of the strong. Ravenous monsters, their eyes shining bright. Courageous hunters looking for a fight. Oh, this this dude is just like Gruntilda. This is where they clash. Their oh, the rhyming. Ooh, look at me, I look so cool. Yo, my favorite pupil. Hey, the race came to learn about wyvern raiding, huh? Awesome. Don't forget to check your armor. I can't watch, but I can lurk. If any questions at all, message the Discord, not me. I'll respond as soon as possible. Alrighty. Thank you, thank you, Zeron. Well, I'm happy to show you how. Okay, let's start off with the basics. Wyvern riding is a gnarly technique. It sure does like saying gnarly a lot. It uses iron silk to bend a monster to your will. While wyvern riding, you can force the monster to attack other monsters or even slam it into walls, dealing massive damage. Ooh. There are a few steps you gotta take to successfully hang ten. This dude is a surfer! Hang ten, gnarly! <laughs> and that's what we'll be practicing today. Oh, thank you for the hydrate, Goldie! You mean to tell me this dude is a hunter? No, he's a surfer. I hardly know her. <laughs> so once you're good to go, head on down. I'll give you more info once you do. It's so extra. Okay, control monster. Right bumper. Tap with B. Okay. Press X to dismount and launch the monster forward. Okay. Checking other monsters while wyvern riding fills your wyvern riding gauge. Can unleash a mounted punisher? Shows how long you can stay mounted. Oh, okay. You'll be bucked off. Okay. Attacks and flinches while wyvern riding can be cancelled by pressing A. Uh huh. Executing evade and emergency evade commands just as you're attacked by another monster will stun it. Huh. Combination spooky. I'll put my decade of experience to good use. <laughs> Wait, were you reading my message or did you also make the joke? I was reading your message. <laughs> okay, let's let's grab you. Endemic life. Okay. Down there? No. I oh, gotta climb down. Can I slide down. Do I... Come, here. Come on down once you're all done up there. Okay. Can I? Okay. Thank God that didn't hurt me. Okay. Get the wire bug. Oh, I got a crab. <gasps> oh. Oof. If it isn't Kimura's brightest flame, 
You ready to ride, Ace? Here's a rundown. My disappointment is immeasurable and my day is ruined. I bet Cove would have made the I hardly know her joke. <sighs> Speaking of antagonizing Elio, I saw Elio's opposite. My opposite? What? What's my opposite? A girl in a skirt at zero degrees Celsius as opposed to a boy in a hoodie at 40 degrees Celsius. <laughs> that sounds worse. First, in order to wyvern ride, you'll need to get a monster into a mountable state. There are lots of ways of... Silk vine. Keep attacking monsters using silk vine attacks. Okay. Once you'll be using a wire bulk for this, it'll consume your wire bulk. Okay. 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 Okay, I think I read that already. Left. Left to break. Oh, and why? Or, or B, okay. Okay, so that's how you do silk mine? Where's a monster to test it out on? <gasps> Look at me. I'm so cool. That's it. Is he gonna attack me? Can I attack it? Can I attack it? Oh, thank you for coming, Nashley! Have a great stream, thank you! Thank you for lurking! Ugh, I hate this dude. Wait, wait. Can't even do anything against it now. What? Okay. Okay. Let trigger B. Good to see you. Yeah. Let trigger B. <laughs> Uh, don't zoom in on it. Okay. Uh, uh. That's it. No. Give it a try. Uh. <laughs> Wait, what? Is so fine. Right. Uh, I don't know. These are the hunting bases. Wait, how do I? How do I target? Wait, what? Eh, eh, eh. Eh, eh. Just kill it? I'm supposed to make a mountain. I don't know how to do this. Okay. Demon mode, okay. 
Oh my. I'm trying to read my freaking. Who's talking about like mounting? Why am I not? Why is this not working? Hey, where is he at? Oof. Oh, this is rough. You have to fight it to put pressure on it to be able to mount. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Just like that. Okay, gets a bit dusty. you see a load of strings on it. Oh, okay. I thought when it was like that, that that meant I could mount it. Okay. Okay, that's how you go in between them. Okay! Okay, okay. Thank you. Thank you. There we go. Okay! Okay, there we go. Look at this. My burn riding time. Okay, that's in the top. Careful. You can't you can't control it very well. Excellent. <laughs> This is Monster Hunter Rise, not Monster Hunter Ride. <laughs> Move on. Yeah. Let's see you launch a monster. Okay. There's an X launches the monster you mounted. Oh, okay. For a wall or obstacle. To regain footing. Okay. Give it a try. Okay, let's see. Good job. 
like you were having a happy time. No, I, I appreciate it. I appreciate it a lot. brother. Once you're wiving Rotting Gods to perform a devastate all mounted Punisher. Okay. After me. That's all. Coming for me. Ah, oh, damn. I wanted to kill them. <laughs> <laughs> Look at my L. Look at that bird. Okay, we got a bunch of food. Oh, my palico grabbed stuff. Didn't even realize that. Okay. So we did that quest. We, we learned how to ride. <laughs> oh wait, hold on. I just got a text. Er, might be my boss. We'll see. Where'd, where'd my phone go? Oh, here. It's right here. Elio and his Elaboid. <laughs> My Elaboid! I should have named him Elaboid! Ah! Damn. Okay, no, my, my boss didn't text me. <laughs> okay, let's explore a bit more around this town then. It's a great wire bug. Okay. Akana the green grocer. Oh, can I can I buy food from you? That fine weapon of yours sure looks heavy. You're finally a hunter of Kamara. That's really something. It's a good look for you. Listen, you know what they say. You are what you eat, so a good hunter should eat good food. Look at Elio getting texts from friends. I did not... <laughs> that was not a text from my friend. That was a spam email. <laughs> uh -huh. Well, all the food here in Kamara is fresh and nutritious. No complaints there, so just eat your fill of it. Can I, can I buy from you? Oh, I, I guess not. I guess she doesn't sell anything. God, this music is so good. A spam email? I never emailed you. <laughs> what, are you spam? No one wants to eat you? Well, that that's not true. A lot of people like spam. Hanenaga. Ever heard about the great wire bug thingies? Well, they're pretty much wire bugs, but bigger. 
Except their wires are much stronger, meaning if you hop on one, they'll launch you way, way farther than a regular old wire bug. Sure. One catch is, once you set them down in some jewel lilies, they ain't moving. Since they're so big, they're hard to steer. Eh? Yep. Once you place one down, you'll be zipping all over the place. They'll be there when you come back, too. Piqued your interest? Alright, here. Some great wire bugs of your very own. Don't say I didn't, ain't, never did nothing for you. Sure. Try it out next time you're on the hunt and spot some jewel lilies. I'm telling you, it'll make the trekking part a breeze. Hang in there. Endemic life form. Has a number of jewel lilies where you can place great wire bugs. Confirm. If you don't have any, you cannot travel with jewel lilies. Have wire bugs in them from the start. Oh, huh. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. I want to eat you. Well, that's not true. Hold up. What? No. <laughs> I was talking about spam. <laughs> I was talking about spam. Look at this dude. Okay, let's do another quest. I'm gonna do four quests today. A taste of heaven. Which quest would you like? Okay, capturing monsters. Gotta capture monsters. It's Pokemon. Don't forget to eat. Don't forget to eat. Don't tell me what to do. <laughs> okay. Alright, let's go. Do do Yeah, Elliot. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll eat soon. <laughs> Don't forget to eat. <laughs> Ready to go. He's up, base. All right, let's see. We're gonna start off simple. Can I either slay it or capture it alive? Capture monsters more complicated than slaying, but you can get materials you wouldn't normally get by carving. It's also faster than slaying a monster, and it cuts down on hunting time, too. The three major steps to a successful capture. Dash the monster until it's weakened. Pretty simple, right? Oh, this is just like Pokemon. You can use a trap to restrain the weakened monster. <laughs> Toss some Trank Bombs at the trap monster until it passes out and BAM! Success! Everything clear so far? Not? Don't worry. I'll walk you through it. Okay. Okay. Gotcha. So date it with items such as Trank Bombs. You cannot carve from these monsters. Okay. I receive materials that are rarely or never available from carving. Also aim with LT and then press X to throw them in that torch. Okay, I'll probably be doing that. And drink ammo to capture the monster. Oh, okay. Let's see. Let's take the okay, we got a pitfall trap. An easy shock trap, and we got some drink bombs. Okay. We shouldn't have done that, but that's fine. Hello. All right. How's it going? It isn't Kimura's brightest flame. <laughs> you shock and pitfall traps when you want to slay a monster. Monster they can't move equals prime thrashing time. Okay. <laughs> Trank bombs. Monsters have to be caught in a trap or weak enough. Otherwise, the item right. does nothing. Okay. And Arzuros. Start attack the monster to weaken it. Once the monster is weak enough. Okay. Blue icon. Uh -huh. Weaken monsters will limp away from a fight. <laughs> be careful not to attack the monster too much or you'll end uh -huh. up slaying it. Okay. Let's do this. Where's he at? Oh, there he Give is. It a try. Please. He is Spamton twice. Spamton. Blue oh, icon, it. white dragon. Where's his 
spike on. I don't see his icon. Oh, is it... Monster icon? Okay, heart's broken. Okay, he got some hearts down. Larger monsters can dish out by the cut the icon. Oh, okay. Now this is the hunter's guard. Actively aggressive towards the hunter. On the move, but still aggressive. A blue icon will be displayed over its icon. Oh, okay. Large monsters will eventually tire out after lots of violent activity. Hard monsters will start slobbering. Move sluggishly, strike less ferociously. Oh man. That's kind of sad. I don't want to watch that. Capture a monster, a pitfall. Okay, a pitfall, a shock trap, and then a train item. Okay, I think I'll use the shock trap. Okay, so. Give it a try. Don Kanai, Whetstone. Okay. What are you doing? What are you doing? Sit it down. Okay. Okay. Stand your toes. What's more from the top? Okay. It. Okay. I gotta be. I gotta be fast. Materials. Oh, it takes two train. Oh, okay. I thought I messed up on the first one. Okay. I'll kill it. I'm supposed to capture it alive, Cal. <laughs> okay, we completed that quest. So we did all of the beginner, like the training quests. Oh, my palico didn't grab anything that time. Buddy one as a- Oh! Wait, what? They have levels? I didn't even notice that. Looks tearfully in homicidal tendencies. Ellie, what did I do? What did- What? 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 I did nothing! I did nothing! I just captured an animal. Probably rehoming it, putting in it, it into an, a sanctuary where they will be cared for and be given lots of food and friends and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's see. Who are we gonna talk to today? I already talked to the simp man. What's in here? <gasps> It's a cat bathing! Look at that cat! Wow! He's got a little ducky! You see? Hold on. I'm sorry, I'm a voyeur. I'm sorry for being a voyeur, but this is cute. Look at him! Hold on. Look. Look at me. Look at me. Look at him. He's got a little. He's got a little. It's like it's like a daughter mug duck. Look at that. That's so cute. Stop watching the cat bathe. You can't make me. <laughs> oh, that was oh that was Ikari. I think I already talked to him. I'm up to my whiskers and deliveries, and they got. When it's done, I'm gonna treat myself to some bunny dango. You can bet your tail I'm excited. <laughs> Okay, rice ball artist Seihaku. You're a real hunter now? 
You definitely look pretty slick carrying around that. <gasps> look at that! Look at that onigiri! It looks like a cat! <laughs> definitely look pretty slick carrying around that big weapon. Can I hold it? No? Oh man. When Koimitsu saw you earlier, she was like, Wow, Elio Lappy looks so cool. She's single. Yeah. The, this onigiri right here, the, the one on the right underneath my dog, it looks like a cat. I guess she only digs hunters. What's the big deal? Chefs are cool too, and I'm always making rice balls for her. Oh. Yeah, everyone's simping for her. Uh, I mean... Not that I care. I make rice balls for everybody. That's my job. There's nothing special about her. See okay, you got... You wanna sell some? I'm gonna grab her hand and, uh... It's not like that. If something happens, you gotta show the slow ones and Komitsu can't even run 10 yards. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay, I guess he doesn't sell rice balls. Look at that fish. Oh my god. What are you doing? I'm not talking to you. Has Elio been angry since five hours ago? What? Oh. Oh. Mm. Also, that's just my eyebrows. I, I'm not. I'm not enabling anger. That's just my. That's just my default expression. <laughs> I guess I just constantly look angry. I never thought of that that before. But like, the tracking on my eyebrows is how my eyebrows actually are. Okay. Let's go do one more quest. One more. Oh, hello. Alright, so we're done. Have we're done with the training quests. Expedition, what? You're free to explore without a time limit. Fanny won't cause you to fail them. Oh, gather materials or take pictures. Okay, well, I don't really want to do that. Let's do... Holy poly lanterns. Okay, let's see. Deliver eight fire lanterns. Girly village maiden. Fire lanterns are like so pretty, so red, so round. Something about them is simply magical. I totally want to see them all in time, so maybe I should put them in my room? What'd you say? Think you can get me some? Okay. Be careful out there. Now you being shinny mode makes you angrier. <laughs> I knew you always looked angry. Oi. Oi. What are you implying? <laughs> okay. Attacks can draw hunters closer to them? By dashing or wire dashing? Oh. Why is it like the second, third time I hear Valley Girl voice Elliot this week? <laughs> Half of that area will be obscured by fog as you explore the locale. And the monster is a monster you never hunted for. Generic icon. A monster's unique icon in your cohort will mark it. Okay. Cool. Okay. So we gotta get fire lanterns. Carrying transport items and deliver them. Oh, okay. Listen up. Let's go, Azoth. 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 Let me ride. Thank you. Valley Girl Elio is not real. Valley Girl Elio. I got a... Oh, whoa, whoa! A bitter bug. It was like... <gasps> this looks like an animal. This looks like a dog head. What? Look, it's the... It's like a dog head. That's so cute. Hold on. Bernadette? Steal him away from El Monster Hunter. Beat them, bun. <laughs> it's fine. Say hi to him. Steal him away from Elio. Wait, why? Why? 
I said hello, hello barn. How's it going? Look at this dog rock. Okay, so I gotta get fireflies. Is there one over here? What's this like? Oh. What am I doing? <laughs> oh, wait, wait, wait. I wanna get that. I wanna get that. I wanna get Let's that. See. Dun, dun, dun. Wait, who's being stolen from Elio? Who must I steal from Elio? I guess yourself? I, I don't... I don't know what ID meant. By the way, you trust my allure way too much. How is Donal visiting Elio? Oh, yeah. Okay, we got... Oh, is that it? Is this it? Shimmering red berry. A wisp lantern? Oh, I guess that was one. Okay. I shall visit the LEOP as much as I am able to. Oh, let's go. Yeah, baby. Wait, did it just split into two? Oh, this actually makes me feel bad. I saw them like. Bomb bad gee. We got an igniter. Oh. Let's go. Wait. What? Why are you throwing a bomb? Wait. What is this? What the hell was that? Is that a cat? What was that? Am I being an evil mother-in-law to Elio? <laughs> Are you Barnes' mom? Kill them all, make le I mean, me proud. <laughs> Bone will die, I will leave now. Farewell chat and Elio, I shan't be stolen, nor will Elio be taken from- Well, apparently Goldie has, uh, challenged that, uh, today. <laughs> While I was playing our life. I complimented Goldie, and Goldie was like, if you keep acting like that, I might steal you away from Bard. <laughs> I said Goldie was smart, and then Goldie said that they might challenge you. I know Goldie didn't do that. <laughs> Watch the stream. <laughs> what is this? A fish? Fish, a fish, a fish, a fish. Gotta throw hands. <laughs> you will still born before Goldie steals you. Uh uh. Okay, I guess he's gone. You can ga ga jowl. I'll be the announcer if you do. <laughs> or if you do barn. Oh, I wait, wait, why, why is this one dead? I only killed one of them. Does killing one of them kill them all? Kill every last one of them. Wow. Oh, hello, Fern. Daigo party went, what's Daigo? I sense there are two different goals for each party involved in this relationship. Everyone wants to break us up, apparently. <laughs> for it to advance their own means. Everyone in chat wants Barn. Me, Elio, chat, as a while, and Goldie. Okay, I can't go in there. Oh, I can climb up here. Yeah, let's climb. I feel so cool whenever I climb up the wall of oh, Julie's. Oh, we got a great wire bug. Okay, where you where are you gonna take me? Oh, is that a snake? A snake? 
Antidobra. Oh, it's ca oh. I thought it was a monster, and I took out my weapons, but it was just a harvestable. You mean three parties? I haven't even been to three parties. Me neither. The last party just support born Leo. <laughs> okay, I got. Oh, do they like respawn after some time or something? Cause I saw the the white thing light up again. So this is like on a, a fifty minute timer, right? So I, I should still be fine. If I go around and cause a little mischief, a little hee hee ha ha, do a little dongles. Oh, you're already dead. Already dead. Gargwa or Goomba. Let's go, Komaida. Wait, where'd they all go? There were like a bunch here before I got in the fight with it. Now they're all go. Oh, oh, I guess I must have scared them off. Oh, is he harvesting? Was he harvesting? Did I get in your way, buddy? Barnleo was an, an unexpected but wholesome ship, though. Oh, your target? Yeah, my targets are marked on the map. That's the... The... The green things. I, I'm pretty sure. For when you're done exploring. Yee. That's fun. I like... I like doing... I do it the explorer. I do it the explorer. Okay, let's see. Yeah, let's fill out. Let's fill out this map while we, while we still have time for for future quests. This is a pretty pretty simple quest, I think. Let's see. All right. Oh, oh it's like a little village. Oh, hello. Give me your meat and bones, so I can make meat bones. Oh wait, I'm sorry, Azov. Wait, no, I didn't mean to do that. Izuchi. Oh, didn't see you coming. Oh, he's dead. Well, time to get my hands dirty. Time to get my hands dirty. Oh, see you later, ID. Have a good night. Woof. Hi there, love boy Bailey. Welcome, welcome. Making progress. What are these? What are these? Stink mink. Oh, a type of pheromone. You can lure monsters by first using a stink mink. Oh, okay. Cheat either by enraging or using a stink mink will go after player. You lose track of you and move into areas. Okay. You'll be able to have them fight or wrestle over territory kaiju time. Oh! Listen up. My disappointment is immeasurable and my night is ruined. <laughs> what is this? What is this? What, is, what, what are you? What are you? What are you? Oh, okay. They're monsters. Okay. I get confused on which ones are actual monsters and, and which ones are like harvestables. Nothing personal, buddy. So is this your first mon hunt? Yes. This is my my very first monster hunter. And this is like my first like actual quest outside of like the training quests. A territory fight is the easiest way to make a monster mountable. Ooh, okay. So if I want to mount a monster, that would be the way. Not a problem. Other than wearing it down. Okay, that looks like there's another fire lantern nearby, so I'll go pick that up. And kill these guys! Yeah! 
Oh my god. Oh, that's why those other guys died earlier, because they explode. <laughs> so, it must have hurt the other ones when I hit them. At that one, like... You guys remember that lake I saw and I was like, wait, why are there so many dead ones? I only killed one of them. Or maybe my animals killed them. Well, time to get my hands to Awesome, look, seeing people coming into the series. Yee, I I'm really liking the game so far. It seems really fun. And I like the exploring part of it. But I also like how much you can do even when you're not, like, fighting the monsters. Nothing personal, buddy. Wait. Nothing personal, kid. Okay, let's get that. Is it up here? Looks like it's up a rock. Whoops. Ooh. Okay, let's see. Let's find a good area to climb. Okay, if I wait. Okay. Wait, wait. Aren't you climbing? As by Sar is some of the best feeling gameplay of any game series I've played except Dark Souls. Also, it's so weird hearing the English stuff for this game. <laughs> really? Yeah, I got the Komaido voice. Wait, wait. Why are you doing that? I want you to climb up. I see, I see. Come on, go up. Climb up. Wait, why are you jumping? Why aren't you climbing? Should I just aim my thing to go up there? Oh, I'm running out of stamina. I didn't think I ran out of stamina, but I, I am a fool. Okay, so I should go around the other way. Like, let's see. Maybe up here would be a good area? Okay, you got your your stamina back, buddy. Okay. No, you were so close. You're on the verge of greatness. Wait, what is that? I like these little bugs. Do they restore stamina? Oh no, they give you points. Oh wow, your yeah, your stamina goes down really fast. Okay. You get the diamond cross here when aiming a wire bug at the wall, that means you can climb up it. Ah, okay. Thank you. Okay, should maybe let's see. Hmm. I go around here. I'm trying to go back to the areas with. Wait, what? Did I just kick it? <laughs> oh, thank you for following, Love Boy Bailey. Appreciate it a lot. Did you think that funny little bar was for it? I I didn't see it going down that fast. I was like looking at it, and then I guess I wasn't paying very much attention. Ooh, look at this, buddy. Ooh. Well, thank well, time to get my hands dirty. I want to eat some meat. Your character's getting hungry. Oh, oh, that's why the stamina meter shrunk. Oh, okay. Okay, so that's like over here. It's the rations that I'm supposed to eat, right? Oh, okay. Okay. I didn't know that was a thing. Okay. I'll, I'll eat some more meat once I kill these bong... Babongas. Babonga dangly dudes. More often you use your stamina, the, the bar will slowly shrink. Oh, okay. See, no wonder it was so small. Cause I, I could have swore earlier when I saw it that like it was higher. That must be because I've been running so much. Here we go. Alright. Let's 
grab these guys' corpses, and then I'll eat some rations. Okay, yeah, your stamina meter can go even higher than your health. Yeah. Okay. So now I should be able to go up there, right? Wait, what? Hmm? Why did you why did you jump that time? I didn't see the stamina meter. Wait, why are you back here? I guess they respond. Why did you jump that time? to hold the sprint button to climb walls or you let go. Oh, okay. There we go. Okie dokie, okie dokie. You can wire bug again when you jump off the wall, by the way. Oh, okay. Okay, there we go. Got a latch berry. You also don't need That's the wire bug to start it, just sprint at it. Oh, okay. Let's see. Okay, so we got those. So we can I guess I'll come back down here. Since we've been spending a bit of time on this, I should probably get some easy lanterns. Save some more time. If you hit B when in midair after jumping off, you can hang from a wire bug for a bit to recover stamina to continue climbing. Ooh. Oh, this guy's coming for me. Look at him, look at him! Ooh. Ooh, ooh, he's so cool! Oh, these are so cool! Oh my god, oh my god. Oh, they're coming for me. Well, time to get my hands. That's okay. My, my my buddies are taking care of them. Okay. I'll help you guys out. Okay. Are you sticking to dual blades? Or are you gonna try other weapons? I'm not I'm not quite sure buddy. yet. I like the dual weapon. I, I like the dual blades, but I'll probably be trying out some other go. ones some other time. I like, I like going fast. Okay. Let's see. Let's check this out. Oh, there's a... Anything useful in here? Pile. A corpse. Ooh, ooh, that got a lot of stuff. Let's see. Oh, yeah, give me that. Oh, more more poop. I don't want to pick this up, but I'll pick it up. Gotta go mod, so I'll take my leave. Have a good stream and have fun. Thank you, Blue Mage. Have a good time with your mod. All right, we got some more. Okay, we got three of them now. Wait, right, let me let me read my read my buddy. Oh, wait, it was B. I don't know why I thought it was A. <laughs> Alright. Oh, wait, you can fast travel, can't you? To the map. It was... Not that. No, no, no. What button was it? Detailed map. There we go. Because it looks like it was at the camp. <laughs> Try Hunting Horn if you ever do multiple players and play Hunting Horn, people will love you forever. Oh, is that the is that the one that that plays music? Well done, select ye. Okay, let's see. It looks like it might be okay, it looks like it might be up here. Oops. Didn't mean to do that. Okay, 
Okay, well done. Okay, okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, you play songs and buff yourself in the party. Oh, that's like the that was the liar weapon I tried out last time. Whoops. Did you the map? Okay, it's like a bit further down here. Right around here. Ah. Okay. Okay. Come here. You can jump. Let's see. Do a little jump. Ooh. Bam. Jump, jump. Alrighty. Let's go get that other one. Yeah, that that'd be cool. I I really I was thinking. I, I wanted to try that weapon out, the, the the hunting horn. So I might do that next next time, next quest maybe. Oh, they're sleeping. Shh, don't wake them up. Or maybe I will. Oh, whetstone. Okay. That was... This. Now's my chance. My weapon got dull. Oh, I see that. I see that from the gauge. How it's like... Nothing personal, went into buddy. orange. If it goes into red, does that break? Is that... Is this on Switch or PC? PC. I'm playing the Steam version. Is there a monster still here? Yeah. Still heard the hunting music. I guess not. <laughs> okay, we gotta do the climbing again. Damn it, ad break. Oh, uh, I was. I, I am on PC. I am on Steam. Barely got up here. Okay, let's get some more of these. Oh, that gives me two of them. Oh, Thunderbug. Doing great. Didn't have that before. Okay, let's do some more exploring then, since this is like a, a 15 minute quest. I think we still got some time to spare. Wait, okay, what is this? What shoot patch. Here? Oh, bamboo shoots. Ooh. Ah, nice. Did you get Sunbreak with it or just the base game to see if you like it? I plan to get Sunbreak. I was gonna buy it last night after I, uh, well, not last night, two nights ago. Because uh, I played a little bit of this uh, two days ago. And I thought, oh, I'm out of room, I guess. But yeah, I'm definitely gonna buy Sunbreak. Uh, I'm just uh, waiting on my next paycheck, which should be on the the second. But I do want it. I want it. Oh, this is the Azuchi, right? Yeah. Oh, oh wow. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm, I'm harvesting here. Okay. Here we go. Izuchi pelt. All right. Izuchini. 
Alright, let's go this way. We haven't been this way before. Played the game to death when it first came out on Switch, and then when Sunbreak came out on PC, I bought the PC version, and then didn't touch the game again for like six months. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I feel that, though. I, I've been like that with, like, uh, Dead by Daylight. I, I, I'll I get, like, really into it for a while, and then I just won't touch it. <laughs> okay, there should be another one over here. Oh, it must be up this hill. Yeah, okay, don't don't jump, bro. There it is. Okay. Easy peasy. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Now let's see if we can find something before leaving. Fill out the map a little. Well, trying to catch back up to where I was on my Switch save was a pain. Yeah, I could imagine. <laughs> here I come. What did he say? Something here I come. Was it Hino? Yeah, we we working on getting a girlfriend in this game. <laughs> okay, we got target rewards. Oh, that's a lot. Some quest rewards. I oh, got a bunch of items. I guess you can only have 10 of, like, gather items. One of the plunder- buff anglo head. Jagras meat. Yeah, we got a bunch of stuff. Has a whole bunch of items. Okay, that was a pretty good quest, I think. We spent some time to get acquainted with the area. Got a bunch of stuff, killed a bunch of enemies. Pretty good, pretty good. I've been wanting to do four quests, at least, whenever I stream. Since that feels about right in terms of time. So yeah. Came back when I found out they added my favorite fight of any Monster Hunter game I played, which also happened to be from my first Mon Hunt. Oh, what was your first Mon Hunt? Leather vest. Oh, oh, we got the stuff to be able to make, a uh, new equipment. Nice. Okay. But I think I'm gonna end here, uh, for the day with Monster Hunter Rise. Uh, I still gotta do some stuff around the house before I, I go to bed. So I should probably do that before it gets too late. Oh! Thank you for subscribing, Cal! Elio, does war missions eat stream? <laughs> no! No! Oh, Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate, which was on the Wii U. Oh, wow! Yeah, I've heard I've heard about this game series since Try on the Wii, but I've never gotten around to playing it until now. I wanted to get World, but I saw Rise on sales and stuff, and I was like, yeah, I'll, I'll try out Rise. <laughs> Thanks for the stream, no problem. I'll see you guys tomorrow. What are we playing tomorrow? I mean, let me double check my my schedule. My, sh my schedule. I think we're playing Ghost Trick. Yeah, we're playing Ghost Trick and Danganronpa tomorrow. So I'll see you guys then. And have a good night and all that. Have a good night. Be sure to eat, drink, take your medication, and check more game. Oh, oh wait, wait. We still have art time. I completely forgot that was a thing. Okay, hold on. Uh, so that's it for Monster Hunter, but. We do have art time tonight. So let me switch over to this to this screen. Oh, and I should probably save in game. Let me do that real fast. Now let me save. Okay, that that's kind of important. Kind of important to save your game so you don't lose all that progress. <laughs> that would be frustrating. Okay, now I can exit out of the game. Okay. Let me put on some music. That was a very cool transition. Thank you. Uh, I, it's like a, it's a custom commission that I got for the transition. I think in my, I think in my about should have the, the credits for it. Hey, Art. Also, I'm a bit worried because I didn't get, I, I didn't pay to get solved. Eh? What do you mean? <laughs> okay, let me, oh wait, let me put on some music.
Was it like through Twitch Prime or something? Okay, let me put on some Deltarune music and we'll do some art time now. So at the end of some streams, uh, we do art time. And if you uh, draw anything that you would like to be shown, something that, that you made yourself, you can at me on Twitter at Starry Bunny Boy, that is B U N N I E, uh, and let me know that you'd like the art to be shown during art time. Or you can join our Discord and post in the art channels there. So there is the link to the Discord. And yeah! Oh! I didn't pay, it appeared on my screen that I said, oh, okay, so it was like someone, like, uh, I think it might be your, you might have an annual thing set up, Cal, so you might, you might want to check that out. M make sure that you're not paying something that you don't want to pay. <laughs> yeah, you might, you might be set up for an annual subscription then. So, you might want to double check your settings for the subs. <laughs> but yeah, uh, our first piece of art for the night is by Callahan Cruz, who is in chat. And what is this? Isn't it monthly? Yeah, it should be monthly. So, uh, typically, like, most people just sub whenever they want to. Uh, but some people might set up, like, monthly subscriptions. So, like, every month it renews automatically. So, you might wanna- oh. Oh, I said annually. I, I meant monthly, sorry. Yeah, you might want to check to make sure that you don't have it auto set up to pay every month if you don't want to do that. Does photography count as art? I think photography counts as art if you took the pictures. So yeah, this is some art by Calham Cruz. Oh, ooh, this must be part of the, the Angel series that Cal's been drawing art for. Let me... I think Cal's in chat so he could explain it, but... This looks really cool. I love the flame head. I think I've seen this character. I think this is the, the second time I've seen art by Kala, this character. I love how he's got like a flame and it kind of looks like a halo around him too. But it's like a different kind of halo than like the more conventional angels, which makes it look even cooler. Kind of like a, a metal works kind of halo. And then I like the big hands and how he's kind of like, he's got like a, a mitoroska, or not really a mitoroska, a, a marionette inside of him. Oh, it was doing that. Also cool, my art. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it was doing that. Okay, yeah. Good, good thing that you caught on to that, so you don't have to be doing that every month if you don't want to. Are you talking to Cal for like five minutes? I think Cal is in chat. How did you get? I may not be smart. <laughs> but yeah, this is really cool. I love all of the, the folds on the clothes. And this character's design is really cool. Yeah, especially because I'm low on money. Yeah, yeah. I, I I know that. I know the... The, the annual... Or not annual. The monthly subscription thing. Because I used to auto-sub for a bunch of friends. But then I found myself having a lot less money. <laughs> And being like, oh wait, I need to make sure that that's turned off. So, <laughs> good you caught that. And this is really good art, Cal. I I love, it. I love the oversized arms and stuff. Looks so cool. <laughs> it also kind of looks like a doll too, like with the limbs, like like not just the doll that's inside of it, but like parts of the arm kind of look like like doll hinges or whatever, like. Marionette hinges or whatever because I, I used to make a marionette so like it's got like the little holes To like slip the the strings through and stuff looks really nice And then we got some art doo, 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 doo. Let me see uh, ba, 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 ba. So our next piece of art is by Ooh. I, I'm still getting. I'm still learning. I'm still learning people's names that are that I knew. Uh, let me just double check that I am saying their name correctly. Ba -ba -ba -ba. So our next piece of art is by Zeron. Uh, Zeron is a welder, and they made their own weapons. Let's take a look at that. Oh, thank you for the hydrate, Goldie. 
Yeah, so these are some weapons that Zeron made. Look at that. <clears throat> ah, delicious. These are really cool. I really like the, the one on the far left. Is that like a katana? Yo, these look nice. Yeah, I like the one on the left and the one next to it too. It looks like it's really well, like, curved. It looks really cool. And then we got an alternative, like, lighting on these. Supplied by Zero. So, here's another look at the weapons. Yeah, it looks really cool. People that make their own weapons are, are awesome. I wish I could make, like, knives and stuff. This looks really cool. I remember, uh, you know the chicken kitchen place I mentioned? That was part of, like, a, an old-time western area. I remember I would go to the blacksmith there and just watch them make weapons. It's really cool. I managed to get off of work in time for our time! <gasps> Let's go! Welcome back, Jackie! Hello, hello! So yeah, this was art done by Zeron, the art known as Bladecraft. <laughs> and then our next piece of art... I believe this was by Markoy, but let me, let me double check that I am giving proper credit. Okay, yeah, this is by Markoy. This is a, a quick sketch by Mark Hoy. Let's look at this. So is this... This looks like a... What's that one Pokemon? It looks like a Pokemon to me. Is this a Pokemon, Mark Hoy? I'm trying to remember their name. But I can't... Can't quite remember it. But it looks really good. Looks really on point with the model. From what, what I'm seeing in my head of the Pokemon, it looks really on point. Elliot, I feel like you'd literally cut off your fingers on accident. I probably would. I probably would. <laughs> Knowing me, I would. <laughs> uh, looks like King. That was it. I was like, what is the evolved form of Horsey? Yeah, yeah. It does look like King Draw. Okay, that was its name. Thank you. Yeah, it looks really good. Is this King Draw? Looks really nice. And then we got some more art by Callahan Cruz. Kingdra? I hardly know her. Or maybe Queendra? <laughs> Alright. So this is some more of the like like biblical figure drawings done by Cal. So we got Judas. Ooh. It looks like a... Are these like a Binding of Isaac inspired? Or Kashira. Looks very, very binding of as by binding of Azic play for for Judas especially. Like the smile that's bleeding. It looks really cool. Got James. He's got a sword head. Got Peter. I like Peter. Like it's a, a candle with wings and the, the like flames form a halo. And John A. Oh damn. That's crazy. John It looks cool. It, it's like, I could see it being like a, a navigator type. I, I don't know why I'd say that, but I don't know. They're like big and they see all, it looks like like all the eyeballs and the cross. They look really cool. I feel like that would be like either something that would aid you in finding areas or it would be like the big baddie that you gotta fight. It looks really cool. I think that's my favorite one, John 8. <laughs> good art, Cal. Good art, good art, good art. As always, as always. <laughs> and then we got some more art from Cal. And I remember putting a note to myself uh, when I show this. Uh, uh, spider warning. <laughs> spider warning for people and for myself. But I was looking at it and it didn't seem too scary for me, so I will I will I will look at it. So what okay. We're we're gonna ignore the spider for now. We're we're gonna zoom in on this. This is awesome. Chamuel? Bro, this looks so cool. It's like it's like a heart and like like blood vessels and stuff. Like 
Oh, that's so cool. It's like blood vessels making a heart and like heart shapes and all that. That is so cool. Like the arms and everything is so cool. And then we got Ariel. Oh, it's like the Little Mermaid, but like like a dark version of Little Mermaid. Like it's got the tail and like a like a lance and stuff. Oh, that's so cool. Are these like are these like like Madoka Magica maybe? Like Ariel as like a like a witch or something? Oh, uh, this one. This one's really cool. It kind of reminds me of like the Gnosis with their with their the big arm. It's so cool. They're, they're after types of angels, sadly, mostly Catholic Bible, no, not witches. Oh, okay. These are really cool. I like this one with the big arms. And like the, like the little devil tail, devil looking tail, and then like big old halo. And it kind of looks like a dragon on top too. I got wormweed, that's the spider looking one. I mean, I don't like spiders, but it looks cool. It looks awesome. I just don't want to... I don't want to stare at it for too long. I, I don't want to imply that it's bad. I just don't want to stare at like spider looking stuff for too long. <laughs> but great art, Cal. Thank you for sharing this with us. Okay, let me move this over here. Oh, that wasn't the spider one. Oh, it wasn't? It looked kind of furry, so I like didn't want to look at it too much. I thought it was like a tarantula or something, so I wasn't looking at it too much. Okay, here's our next art. Oh, this is this looks like the piece of light we showed earlier, but like uh more more lined with some more stuff here. Ooh. Got like a like a chair, like a, a throne chair. Like with the angels, biblically accurate angels. That looks awesome. I love like the eyeball looking stuff like around the, the headdress and like the the bottom parts. Oh and how the, the legs of the <laughs> the legs of the chair. Oh, that looks awesome. Yeah, thrones. Yeah, thrones. Oh, and that's the guardian angel. Oh, that's what that angel is. It's more about the angels within my series. That's awesome. I like how thrones is done. Like, it's a throne and it also looks like the, the representation for the angels thrones that I've seen around. Like, the like ringy looking angels I see a lot of. That looks awesome. I love that. <laughs> okay, is... Okay. Just double checking. I kind of swore I saved one that was spider-based, but maybe I didn't. Okay. Our next piece of art is by Callahan Cruz. Again. They're kind of like doppels when they're connected to a person to protect them. Ooh. Doppels. Hey, right, so here's some more of the guardian angel. Oh, it's a god. Oh, some concepts for it. So, I got this one. Looks most like uh, the one that we've been seeing. Oh, and it looks like it's. Is that like a, a horn? With like a flame on it. Ooh, this one's cool. Jophiel. Color yellow, wisdom, and virtue. It's like a light bulb, because the light bulb, like, you, you gotta. You gotta think. Oh, that's so cool! Oh, and it... Oh, that's cool. I didn't notice this. So, there's like a person, like... And their head is like a book. Because their knowledge. That's so cool. Got a lot of thought put in that one. And we got... Michael, Will... Ooh. Looks like a... Like a poltergeist or something. Something that'll be like... Over your bed, watching you. <laughs> Ooh, this song is really good. This is a really nice cover. Oh wait, no, that oh that was just a part of the opening song. I I don't know why it transitioned into a different song. I'm dumb. Anyway, 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 anyway. Really awesome art, Cal, as always. Yeah, I need to finish my goal. I'm looking forward to seeing it. These look awesome. You put a lot of thought into these. And then our next piece of art is by Goldie Other. And Goldie Other supplied a trigger warning for uh, cigarettes and smoking. So if you're sensitive to that, I'll let you know when the image is gone. But this is some art from Goldie. And look at this. This is really cool. I love Goldie's like uh, monochrome drawings that they do. 
Like, I love the details in the hair. Yeah, I- Oh, and look at the- the texture on the mouth, too. There's so much, like, like, glossy. It looks really nice and glossy. Oh, I really love the effect of the smoke and the hair. The hair is so detailed. It looks awesome. This is so cool, Goldie! I love it, too. It's great. I always get happy seeing Goldie's art. It's like a- it's like a little treat. <laughs> Look at that. Ah, oh, thank you. No problem. Thank you for sharing your art with us, Goldie. I love it. And the eyes are really cool, too. I love all the details on the lashes. That's awesome. And then we got some art by Snowfall Shiryuki. I wasn't sure if I, I showed her art of this on stream or if I just reacted to it when when they, like, DM'd me it. So I'm showing it here just to, to cover my bases because they... Every person's art deserves to be appreciated. So this is art by Shiryuki, and she drew Song in a bikini. And look at that! I I I love like how they did the the hands on uh, Song. It looks like she's uh like holding up the the swimsuit, but since she doesn't have any hands, like there. I don't know. I don't know. It's just like, I don't know why I really like that. <laughs> I like the hands on this a lot. And the booba. The eyes are really nicely detailed too. Look at that. She's trying her best to put the top on. Yes. Very, very, <laughs> very sexy song. I love the pixelation thingy at the bottom. Oh yeah, cause, cause song's like a... Song is a computer virus ghost. <laughs> Looks really good. It, it kind of reminds me of N.A. Uh, how like uh, N.A.'s legs do the, the little cutoff point. Because she's like a, a program. <laughs> love it. Love it, love it. Good art. Good art, Shiryuki. And again, I'm sure Song was doubly happy to get this. <laughs> Your wifey. <laughs> I love that effect. Oh my god. Yes, yeah, same. I remember I liked drawing N.A. Specifically because I liked drawing the ends of her feet with the little cut-off pixely thing. <laughs> and then we got some more art by Goldie. So let's look at this. So look at this. Lesbians in color. This is so cool when I saw this. Like I've seen the monochrome version. But it being color just adds a whole other layer to it. I like drawing N.A. because I didn't like to draw feet. <laughs> that too! I love all the like strands that stand out in this. It's really nice. And the eyeballs. Oh, I love the the lighting here. Like around the, the glove and everything. It's so cool. You got a really good grasp on lighting, Goldie. Really good. Love their poses. Very dynamic. I love the colors. Same! I love how there's like a, a lot of like dynamic... Like lighting and shading here. Like you can see where the light sources are on the characters. It's really cool. Also, I love the girl on the right's abs. Like... Mm, baby! <laughs> but I also really like the character on the left. There's always... There's just something about white-haired... Red eye characters that always get me. I also really love the the like uh you can see the bags under her eyes too. Like it's a nice little effect. Me, yeah, I'm glad I managed to capture the gem glow well. Yeah, you did great. I know, I know, right? Abs. <laughs> I want to be buried in them. <laughs> love this. Excellent art as always, Goldie. Love, you love to see it. Love to see the art. And let me just double check in the Discord to make sure I didn't miss any other art by people. Yeah, literally the 27 white hair characters staring at you right now. <laughs> okay, yeah, it looked like there was another post. Yes, yes, okay. I, I saw someone typing in the art channel while I was getting ready for art time, so I'm like, oh, someone's gonna post, huh? So yeah, 
this is some art by Imitation Flower Jackie. Also, is it okay if I show the, the Fair There City art if you're still in chat? Crimson Hair Thread, Jackie. So this is some art that they did recently for Identity V. Look at that. Oh, is this for the, the Secret Santa thing? Hey, thank you so much. I'm kind of proud of that one. <laughs> you should be. You should be. It's great. Oh, you did it. <laughs> cute. It's so cute. I love like the lining on the, the trees and stuff. It's got this nice, I don't know. There's like this nice feel to it. It, it kind of, I, I don't know what it is about the lining of this, but it makes me feel comfy. Yeah, it's okay. Thank you. Secret is that there is no Santa. <laughs> oh, scales over to send quick thing. Just FYI, I didn't draw the background and read only the chibis. Oh, I see, I see. Oh. Well, the chibis are super cute! It's an icon for Ace Vic Discord server. Oh yeah, you always do like little seasonal icons. This is cute! I love how, uh... What? Aesop. I like Aesop's little face mask. Adorable. He's got like a little snowman on him. Is that like one of the pets that you get in Identity V? <laughs> I also like how Vic got like the little reindeer horns. Adorable! The boyfriends! <laughs> so cute! So cute! And then we also got... Let me drop this in. Do I have the base image saved? Yes. So this is also by Crimson Red Thread, Jackie. Uh, this is some art that I asked them, I requested them to do for the, the Fair There City. Uh, VOD, so if you if you watch my YouTube videos, you probably already saw this, but here it is in its full glory It's me hugging piggy log because he's a very good boy It's just this butler cafe outfit from last year. Lol. Oh, I see. Yeah, look at that I also I'm, I'm also very grateful that you did the the logo like you you, you drew the logo because I was sitting there and I was like I'm not supposed to use any thing from the game, but I want to like, say Fair There City. I want it to look kind of similar to the vibe of the game, and then you just did it! So I didn't have to worry about that. <laughs> it's super cute. I, I love this art. I love- I love Pikula. Pikula looks so adorable in this, like with his hands and the blush is so cute. <laughs> I- I just want to hold Pikula forever and hold him and keep him tight. I also want to hold Tarakodo. I- I'm very worried. I'm very worried about Katakoro. I I need to make sure he's okay. Like next stream I'm going to be like a like a lost puppy without him. I need him. Pigula best Konko. Yes. <laughs> yes. But yeah, that should be it for the art for night. Yep, yep. 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 I think so. Yep. That is it. So yeah, thank you guys for coming. And I'll see you guys tomorrow, okay? We'll be doing Ghost Trick and Danganronpa. So I'll see you guys then. Have a good night, everyone. Yeah, I'm just glad I got a similar looking brush to the logo. Yeah, it looks very similar. It looks so cool. Thank you so much. I also found like a, a nice little like a, a crayon texture text to use for like the numbers for the, the YouTube VODs, which made me happy. <laughs> Oh, and another thing I wanted to point out about this is I love the the frame around it with the eyeballs. It looks really cool. But anyway, <laughs> if I if I kept talking about art, I'd just be sitting here for like another hour. <laughs> but yeah, thank you guys for coming. I'll see you guys later. Have a good night. Bye bye.